Hey everyone, I'm in Farming Simulator 22 and here I'm going to show you how to cultivate a field. So once you've harvested the field, it'll look like this. Once you've sucked up all the straw, if you're not sure how to do that, have a little look at my other tutorials. Uh, and what we want to do is turn this field into a cultivated one, which will look like this. So this is a cultivated field ready for sowing seed. So let's go back to the, uh, the field that's been harvested but not cultivated. What do we need? We need a tractor. Uh, we need a weight and we need a cultivator. I'm going to show you where you buy these in the shop if you've not got these. The starting farm gives you these as a default to you know learn the basics, but if you want to buy them from scratch, we'll do that in just a sec. Um, what we do is we go to the screens button, and then when you're on here, you can either go and right button over to packs and then have a little look at grain, and it will give you a suggested tractor and also a little cultivator here. Um, and a weight. So the weight is used to keep the tractor's wheels on the ground and improves its balance. That's recommended for this. Now you don't have to go with that cultivator. You can go for a different one. If we LB up, we can go here and you will see a selection of different things. Uh, where are cultivators? There they are. Cultivators or plow. Take pick, but cultivator. There's the little one that we've got. So you can see this one does 2.5 meter width. We could get a bigger one, three meters, four meters, five five to eight, six meters, seven meters, eight meters, 12 meters. Man, some of these are huge. So of course they go up in price, um, but the bigger cultivators are gonna cultivate a big field quicker, but at a much larger expense. So they'll work in a similar fashion. So we'll just go with the default one uh, and just show you how this is. Um, one thing to bear in mind is if you're gonna use some of these bigger ones, you'll probably need a bigger tractor, a bit more power to pull the thing along. Um, so. Yeah, let's have a little look. Let's back out. Right, so here's our tractor. So how do we attach everything? Um, obviously, you've got to be driving the tractor and then be near the things that you want to attach to. So the first thing I'll, I'll hit is A to attach the cultivator at the back. Um, so if you saw that, uh, and then I'm going to be attaching the weight at the front also by pressing A. Now, they were nicely positioned for me. If they're not, one thing I just want to point out, particularly the weight, uh, if we just detach it, if you have a little look there, can you see it's like got a, a different shape on the front as it does at the back? Um, so you want to have the U shape kind of pointed towards the tractor um, for it to attach, otherwise it can't attach. So if you've gone to the shop to buy it, make sure it's that way around, otherwise it will not attach. Okay, so once that's in place and we're all good, uh, drive it to the field where you want to do your cultivating. I'm using the D-pad down just to zoom out a bit so I can see a bit better. Quite annoying, there's a tree there though. Just drive forward a little bit. And you can see if we go to the side view, the cultivator is up in the air at the minute. So we need to put that down. So hold down LB and then lower the weight by pressing B. Uh, I'm going mad. Not that. Sorry. Let me just lift that up. We're on the wrong thing. That's why. Um, we need to select the next tool, which is Y. So if you look just above where it says RB on those controls on the top left, I had the uh, weight activated as the active tool. Um, so I hit Y and then it switches to the... Uh, cultivator at the back you see the little highlighted bit of the icon shows at the back now and now when I hit LB I've got the option to lower the cultivator so the cultivator is now ready to cultivate the land and then we just drive forward and try and do it in a line and just drive forwards I don't think it really matters how fast you go with the cultivator um, you just gotta you know sort the field out um, but you obviously want to make sure you cultivate all of the field when you're at the end here you can lift the cultivator by hitting lb and then hold b to lift it up and this is pretty easy to turn around right trigger and then i'm turning my wheels the other way left trigger and then just turn around and line it back up again and your main job here is just to make sure that all of the field is cultivated so you're going to be doing it in lines like so and then when you're ready lower the cultivator again I think I might have, oh, I'm a little bit, a little bit across there. I made a bit of a mess of that one. Wasn't quite lined up. It doesn't really matter. So when you know what you're doing, it's relatively quick to do. Now, if you're feeling lazy or you're not sure what you're doing with it, you can hire an AI worker to do the job for you. This tree is really annoying where that tree is. There we go. And we just line that up, B. So as you're cultivating, you can see the option for B to hire a worker. So if I hit B, you can see now that dude has changed in there and it's a worker that I've got uh, applied now who will do the cultivating for me. And we should see that they'll carry on and do a nice neat job for us. That's interesting. 
Will they do a good job? Let's see. Yeah, okay, they're lining that up nicely. So they will go ahead and do it. They, that will obviously cost you money if you don't do the cultivating yourself, um, but they will do it for you and hopefully do a nice job of cultivating the field for you. Now you can see how the cultivating is going um, by hitting the map icon, which is your menus button. And then when you're on this um, page here, you can change your filters using your uh, left stick. And what we should see if we zoom in uh, with the right trigger is the part of this is now cultivated. So blue means it's cultivated. Um, the uh, one here means it's harvested. Um, so this is where we're good to cultivate the field. Um, and yeah, that's it really. So principle would be the same if you wanted to plow the field or cultivate the field. But in this case, we're cultivating the field ready to sow the seeds. I hope that was useful to you. If it was, give us a thumbs up, please. That's much appreciated. Any comments, welcome. If I missed anything, do let me know, but I don't think we did. Looks looks good to me. Looks like we're, we're getting there. Um, and if you're interested in this sort of stuff, have a little look at the rest of my channel. I'm trying to cover as much on Farming Simulator 22 as I can uh, with tutorials to help you out. So anything you're stuck on, let me know in the comments as well. I'll do my best to help you. Thanks so much for watching.